I noticed that full on freak is live over there. But has anybody know, uh, noticed that since this freak, Hayes Rosewater, has come to our community? Now, don't get me wrong, our community was far from being perfect before full on freak got here. But since they've been here, this community has gotten 10 times worse. Everyone in this community has been called a trans basher. I never heard that until full on freak got here. She's over there right now. She's got a picture of serendipity as her avatar with an eggplant in her mouth. I don't know what she said about me. Something about sucking a uh, oh, I know what she said. My voice is a boner killer. Whose boner did I kill? Full on freak. Your boner? Did I kill your boner? Because I would hope so. I would hope that every time you hear my voice, your crotch drops a couple inches. He is a troll who's, who's dragging people around by their nose. I'm tired of her being... Uh, come down my throat. Uh, I, I swore I was going to. Hey, Lorley, I swore I was going to stay away from her. Hey, pearls of wisdom, Ava Lynn. No one irritates me more than. Yep, yeah, she's the most passive aggressive. She's a psychopath. She really is. No one is going to force that person down my throat. And I feel like that's what's been trying to go on for the last few weeks. Every time you say boo about this woman, man, I don't know what she is. Person. Every time you say boo about this person, she fires up a live stream, calls you a donkey, and says frick about 50 times. And she goes on and on and on about how bad this community is. Well, guess what? Fucking pack your bags and go back to where you come from. You're a troll. You want to say Sarah and Dippity needed attention? Well, Sarah and Dippity didn't have to create three different troll accounts to get into a, a private stream last night that she wasn't welcome in. That was you, full-on freak. You were an imaginary character until Randy brought you to life. And for that, Randy, I'll never forgive you. I still love you, but I'll never forgive you for bringing that imaginary character to life. Now, this will be a one-and-done for full-on freak. Because I'm not going to give her what she's looking for, which is her. She's an attention seeking psycho. We have said nothing. We have just said and said nothing. Now, I'm one and done with this too. I, this woman has been allowed into our community. I am tired of her being coddled. I am tired of her every time that somebody says something about her, we have to give her a damn bottle. And we have to, you know, poor baby, poor baby. How many people in this community has she called a whore? Has she put down? Has she called the village idiot, a donkey, uh, you know, so many words. And what Sarah said she was... That was weird. She didn't say, you're weird. She said, that was weird. And it was weird. You know? Oh, can I see your boobs? Can I have your bra? That's weird. If a can man I was... your bra? I know. If a man said that, that man would be out of this community. And we would have nothing to do with that man. She should not be allowed to get away with this crap. Much, it must suck to be you, full-on freak. It must really suck to be a 40-something-year-old woman who's got nothing better to do 
than to create troll accounts and troll the internet. And everybody, your children are more mature than you are. I am sick of it. This person deserves no attention. Last night, I went in a private meeting in a membership that I paid for, and that bitch went in there three different times to interrupt it. You need attention much? You need attention to the point I finally left. Because she had me so pissed off that, you know, I and what do you do? She just keeps invading people. She comes under troll names. She makes clones, everything else. You know, I remember a guy that was thrown out of the community because he made a remark, a, a remark that, you know, he was going to cut off somebody's fingers. No. And, he, and he apologized. He did everything else. And he was a troll, and he was not a nice person, and he was basically a piece of shit. But he was thrown out of this community, bam, gone. Did you see anybody coddle him? I'm tired of it. I'm tired of it. I, You know, I made one comment one time. And he said, Mom, she got the link because she created a clone account of somebody that really is a member and led um, well, Diane she made. To- yeah, to believe that, yeah, she made she made a clone account, and then she came in under Wendy. I'm not going to say the other... Now, I'm that's not, somebody I'm, that needs attention, okay? That's somebody who needs attention. If, so, right, if somebody looks at you and says, hey, I'm having a party, but you're not invited, do you go anyways? No shit. You can't then, beat on the door screen and let me in, let me in. That's somebody that needs attention. This person has caused more of a divide than I've ever seen in this community before. For weeks. And we- it's been FOD, 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 FOD. And I kept saying. I'm not going to feed into this. I'm not going to go live about her. I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to give her what she wants. But when she starts attacking my friends and saying things that are untrue, when she quits being a crybaby is when she might a Simon simple. You know, you got to remember that this person came into this community calling CPS on someone. Someone that she did it out of nothing but spite. And I don't care how you feel about this someone. They did it out of spite. Which out put of children spite. in harm's way. Yep. Who else would get away with calling CPS out of nothing but just pure spite? Nobody. I, that's why I want to know why do we why are we accepting this why why do we accept it because I can guarantee you if I knew this person in real life I sure wouldn't be taking her to lunch well you know I won't be taking her to lunch because my voice kills her boner I'm just over her I'm over every time you say boo about her she they, whatever, full-on problem. That's exactly right. And I'm, she has busted up friendships. Uh, she has banned people from her chat if they associate with certain people. She has come between people on here that have been good friends for years that, thank God, I hope they're keeping it behind the scenes. But... This person is, she's a wackadoo. I don't care what anybody says. I have a right to my opinion, and my opinion is this person is a wackadoo. The troll she has set out to burn down, insert herself in every stream that she can. The truth, trolls connected with other trolls. It's a sick mental game. Oh, I totally believe you, Simon. And I believe it goes way deeper than just this one little freak woman. 
or man or whatever. See, I don't even I, I don't even know person. Okay, I, I, I don't care I what I call same her person. anymore. Since she told me that I could kill her boner from from this point on, she's a d. She's a he. What you wearing? Khakis. Well, if she's a he, the way that she talked to Molly the other day, she should be off YouTube. Or he should. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> because no man, I guarantee you, if Wogs got up there, or if Simon got up there, or, well, maybe not Brian. He hasn't been run off yet. But if either one of those men got up there that are real men, got up there and said something like that to Molly, do you think this community would take that? She mailed sex items. Oh, my God, i got to catch that one. She did. She mailed sex items to One Love's home and ran her off the Internet Then got upset when One Love threatened to call FBI. Then the person turned around to make one love the bad guy. She did it to Aaron, too. Yep. Yeah, I'm telling you, the woman is a freak. You know, when Aaron F. first come out with this, you know, I kind of thought, mm, it sounds, you know, it sounds a little hinky. It sounds a little hinky until I actually got to know, when I say got to know, got to see the person that Aaron was talking about. And then I thought, by God, I believe Aaron. I, I believe did that woman cost her her job. I believe that. I believe it, too. I believe that there's been a lot of things that have been done in this community that we don't know about by this person. Back with me. It does make people uncomfortable when she says things like that. Are you available? And, you know, when you talk about people's breast the way she does and then when she talks about these kind of things while playing Fortnite, knowing that kids are listening you know it, it's just it's not okay and the only reason i'm going in so hard on her is because she had no right to out my personal stuff yeah maybe i've told a few people here and there but not 300 people in a chat and that was for me to do not you fod fob Oh, yeah. She she hated it when she got um, called out, didn't she? When she yeah. got, when her, uh, when, when, when she got called out, she, she cried for what, a week? Because that was her story to tell, right? But you're right. not entitled to your story, Sarah. Just like she doesn't have to share it. But she doesn't have to go around acting like a big old donkey dick either. Trying to keep people totally confused all the time. I'm tired of it. I don't play games very well. She's been here too long causing too much trouble. Yeah, she has. And it's a divide and conquer tactic because every single little click, if that's what people want to call it, she she gets in there and she divides everyone. And she gets yep. people into arguments. It's like she thrives off of the drama that she creates. And it, it, it's insane to me. I mean, you know. Well, you, she, you were there last night, Sarah, when she did that in Diane's, you know, private yeah. chat. Yeah. Uh, you know, and I mean, okay. She let's, just said. Let's think about it, everyone. She just said she um, wouldn't mind sexually harassing a person 45 minutes ago. She does it all the time. She, she sele- sexually harasses people all the time. I, I, I don't want to. I don't want to play any more games with this person. And I consider myself part of this community. And I'm going to. Yes, it is devious, Pixie Sticks. To clone accounts is devious. There's no other reason to clone somebody's account. Okay, you tell me who in this community would clone an account and get away with it. I remember when oh, no. Laura made a clone account of. Carla, and she got drugged everywhere. Yeah. Do you guys remember? I oh, remember. Yeah. I remember. Yeah. So why is it okay for FOD to make one of Molly Go Lightly and of Wendy and of Diane and of... <clears throat> There's been so many that she's done. I, it's ridiculous. Exactly, Mommy of Three. Exactly. 
Yeah, she does have the mentality of a teenager, full on diaper. You're right. As I call somebody full on diaper, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> that kind of struck me. That kind of struck me as funny. I'm sorry. Well, I-